Hi folks, Mr. Teslonian here. You may remember back in 2015 I showed you how you could build your own homemade Tesla turbine right here out of an old stepper motor from a CNC mill. Today it's 2020, we're going through the COVID-19 pandemic and after almost five solid years of seasonal use to produce electricity from the air pressure produced from my tromp hammer, which I'll also put a link to at the end of this video, Today what we're going to do is do some maintenance to this little Tesla turbine, but before I do it, I just thought I'd put together a little generator head set up here and do some tests for you. Just to show you, after all these years, this little Tesla turbine still produces a large amount of energy from a very small amount of airflow. Let's go ahead and start this thing out and see how many amps we produce. Well, I noticed there on the film after watching that that we couldn't see the light light up at all, yet we could see up to six amps on the meter there. I've got the meter set up for voltage. We're going to do our second test. I'm going to turn out a few more of the lights here. Hopefully we can see a little bit better the LED light light up when we spin this thing up to full voltage. So let's go ahead and get this thing going and do a voltage test. I did see about six amps on that amperage test. Let's see how much voltage we produce. So it looked like we were producing about three solid volts, a little bit more than that. We also got up to about six solid amps when we were running it for the amperage test. What is that, about 18 watts of production? That's not very bad for such a little tiny motor, especially something with such low voltage. One final test here tonight, I've removed the meter from the system. I'm going to go ahead and start killing all the lights while I'm talking to you. And then we're going to fire this thing up in the dark just to see how nice and bright that LED is. Let's go ahead and do that. Here we go. 